Hello friends, today I'm going to show you some of the interesting transactions when you are trading and when you are committing X amount of sales and uh, then customer is coming uh, back after you know even registering the entire payment and registering less quantities. How system will manage and you will get the transactions. So here I'm uh, trying to sell one product which is mobile. Let's say I am selling two units right now to a customer of the mobile. I confirm the order and as it is M2 type order, it will generate one PO. Okay. I confirm the PO and before I receive the product, my customer is coming and saying, no, I don't need two, I need only one. Okay. But before that also, Let's say on the basis of his registered two units, I am generating full invoice of two products. And now a customer is coming and saying he needs only one unit. So here you can see I have still invoice entire amount, but still the invoice status is two invoice. And against my purchase also. I am receiving, I am going to receive two units, but here Odoo has generated one exception. See, if you go to your purchase order window, the another department purchase will see one warnings over here. So, this is very important sign uh, one has to read and see the message what it says. So, SO49, which was booked, have now you know one unit of order instead of two. And now, system will allow me even to reduce the quantity. Okay, and in my receipt also, I can now go and have one unit as a done. And we'll the transaction. Now I can say no back order to my purchase also. So purchase order transaction is fully done. Now I'm going back to my sales order. In sales order, one quantity is there. I need to deliver one. So what I will do is I will set quantity one and I am delivering. And here system is suggesting me to create invoice again. Why? This is the better sign Olu is giving right now. I already have one invoice for the same seller sell worth 40,000. But as I have sold and delivered only one unit, system is asking me to create invoice again. And as soon as I create this invoice, the Olu has created one credit note. So, now credit note transaction can be generated based on my, uh, you know, reduced quantity or short deliveries also. And that's how now my sales order will complete and say fully invoice status over here. Fine. So, this is how uh, we can handle some of our transaction within purchase and sales. And here to review and uh, to remove this warning, you can simply say done and exceptions will be and here also in receipt, I can say it's taken care of. That's it. So no exceptions. You can see now onwards, everything is clear over here between my sales and purchase. So with Odoo 16s, uh, we are getting some of the intelligent, uh, uh, you know, inline uh, signs which can help us to identify transactions are incomplete or it requires some attention with the warning. Hope this helps. Thank you.